Alrighty, good morning, good morning. You can see I'm back at the bridge. Uh, Donna from Stanimals just dropped me off two minutes ago. Put this boat anchor back on my back. Uh, got everything I need from here to here to Waynesboro. So I think that's going to be four and a half, five days, whatever that is. Again, I checked when uh, I was in town. I don't have to go crazy on my mileage. Um, actually, it's only, I only have to do less than 13 miles a day average to get to uh, get to the wife on time, and that actually will still afford me uh, a day in there that's a zero. <laughs> so that's that. But that's about it for right now. Um, going back across the road, and we'll. Uh, We'll catch you on the other side. Got a big, uh, big climb this morning, uh, a couple thousand feet over the course of five miles. So we'll see what it does. All right, guys, we'll see you up the trail. All right, come to this very nice little footbridge in honor of the Park family and in memory of Pancake Mike. All righty. Yeah, that's a nice one. And look at that. We start already. Just couldn't give me a break. Just couldn't let me go flat, even ground for a half a mile. I walked across the road, come across the bridge, and boom. All right. We're going up. See ya. All right. Not sure got to be over halfway up here because I'm getting as tall as some of the mountains around but they're uh, there you go right down there is the footbridge <coughs> so that's where I've come from that footbridge right to here in the past couple hours so but beautiful shot this morning look at that, how nice that is Virginia's giving up some views on this Sunday morning. It's kind of nice. Alright, gonna sit here and enjoy this. Then continue on up. Alright, we'll see ya. Bye. Not sure if you can see this with the sun. But it says Shane River Footbridge 3.7. So it's 9.35 right now. I left the footbridge at... 750. So that's not too bad. 3.7 miles in that hour, a little over an hour and a half coming up this big old hill. All right. On to Bluff Mountain, 5.2. All right, let's go. All right, a little bit farther up. Virginia's giving up some more views today. And I have a feeling that knob over there behind that tree, that's where we're heading. Because yep. you know why I know it is? Because it's the tallest one around. And that's what AT seems to do. Find the tallest tree, the tallest mountain, and aim for it. All right, we'll see you up there. Yeah. All right. Just got up over top of that little climb, 2,300 feet, it took me two hours and 15 minutes to go 4.8 miles and climb 2,300 feet. So I didn't think that was too bad. Tons of switchbacks on that first section. That last little bump, not so many. Oh, look at that. About the loneliest cloud in the world right there. It's the only one in the whole sky. <laughs> All right, just gonna go a little farther, take a break, have a, a first lunch break, because I packed out a sub for lunch. Might eat half of it. It's burning a hole in the pack. All right, we'll see ya. <laughs> Bye. All right, a little windy up here, but this is the top of Bluff Mountain. Not sure what that is down there, maybe Buena Vista, not sure.
A nice views. Nice views. Okay. And some even a little extra on the other side. Top for another one. And now we go down. We go up and we go down. Alright, see you down the trail. So pro so probably one of the better things that I've done in a while. Bought some sweet tea when I was in Glasgow. Filled up two one liter of smart water bottles. Froze it in the freezer last night. And so all morning so far. I have been doing nothing but, well, hiking of course, but enjoying ice cold sweet tea every time I need a drink. Yeah, baby. Still a big chunk of ice in there. <laughs> it's the little things. Leave it alone. Alright, bye. Alright, just made it to Punch Bowl Shelter. Nice little place. Got a little a pond right there of some sort but no I'm already 12 miles in for the day so I'm not in a big hurry and it's only about one o'clock so I'm just gonna hang out here for a little bit rest my feet because hey I can all right we'll see you guys back up the trail all right here you go Somebody's version of the 800 mile mark. 800 miles. So far from Georgia. Alrighty. It's <laughs> a lot of miles. Alright. Just think we only have 1,400 more. <laughs> yeah. Alright. We'll see you guys. Bye now. Alright. I'm going to do another little suspension bridge. This one is over the... Hold on, I'm looking at my uh, book. Peddler River Bridge is the name of this one. This is the Peddler River Bridge. have a little bounce to it <laughs> but uh, anyway that's it only got about another I'm actually gonna get some water here and then uh, head into the woods and just see where I can find a camping spot not gonna be at a shelter tonight it's supposed to be nice weather so just gonna head up the trail see what I can find all right see ya so uh, here I am it's four o'clock and, uh, oops, sorry, watch the big old fat paw there. Uh, and because I got a good start and because I uh, made some good time today, <laughs> I got 16 miles done, and it's just 4 o'clock. So I uh, found this nice little, just past uh, that last uh, suspension bridge, about a mile, maybe a mile up the trail, which was kind of a pain because uh, I filled up 3 liters of water plus 2 res. <laughs> Two of the um, Sawyer squeeze bags. One's a 32 ounce. One's a 64 ounce. So I <laughs> I huffed uh, about a gallon and a half of water up this little rise to my little campsite here. But uh, this is going to be it for the night. Uh, I'm just getting the old hammock set up. Uh, it's kind of comfy here, so I decided, hey, I'll just put the video on. But uh, good, 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 uh, good track today. Yeah, see, it bugs me. I don't know. Every so often, it just bugs me. Uh, but uh, that first ride, that first uh, climb, 2,300 feet over the four and a half miles or so, that was uh, that was a good climb. Um, but then uh, after that, it was just uh, you know 
but going up to uh, Bluff Mountain was like 700 more, uh, not too bad. And then downs and arounds and ups and nothing too big, um, you know, coming coming the rest of the way. So it is what it is. Nice little spot. Wind's blowing a little bit, not too strong. Um, there's a reservoir or something. I saw a dam and water going over a spillway. I wish it was a little bit closer and everything else because I'd go explore that one. That'd be kind of a cool thing to do. But uh, but this is going to be it for tonight. I uh, packed out a sub from uh, Sato's there in, uh, in uh, Glasgow. So that's going to be dinner. Still have a tiny bit of sweet tea left. Didn't drink a lot of a lot of water today. I always drink a lot when we're in town and that first day out of town it seems like I never drink a lot. So, uh, But I got plenty of water for night. I know that. So that's about it for this evening. Not sure if the wind dies down. There's a little place for a fire pit just over there behind. Maybe I'll uh, do something there. If not, uh, that's about it. Alright guys. If something else crazy happens before, uh, before evening, I'll... Uh, Turn the video back on. If not, we'll see you tomorrow. All right, guys. Thanks for following along. As soon as I can hit the button.